Welcome back everyone. So, this video I got a lot from eBay. It's Mega Blocks. It's not Army Men this time. But um yeah, I've got a bunch of classic sets that uh I would have loved to have when I was younger. Anyway, let's see what we got in this box. So there's not a lot of room in this box. As you can see, most of the stuff's just sort of like thrown together. It's a bit cramped in here, but um, yeah, we'll get some of the stuff out. I'll do some repairs and then show it off. So first off, I'm going to show the figures that came in the box. If you're wondering why there's a plug in the background, that's just to hold the black paper up. But yeah, let's take a look at what we have. So we've got some classic Spartans here. I really like this mold of Spartans, just very nostalgic. And same with the Elites, very nostalgic right there. I remember getting a lot of these when I was younger. And those really tiny grunts. <laughs> Plasma pistols just look gigantic on them. Uh, I'm glad they changed the design of them as they went along. Next we have this mongoose and this turret from this small box. I think I remember getting this when I was younger. Yeah, you can see how much the design of things have changed from mega blocks to mega constructs over the years. So look how bland the turret looks. So next up we have the Wolverine from the UNSC Wolverine set, uh, the Hunter and the Marine, I've already shown them off, but this looks pretty good. I had to do some repairs, so some of the stuff might not be where it's meant to be, but it is what it is. Uh, yeah, I really like the design of this Wolverine, it's very nice looking. Next up we have the Covenant Banshee, if you ask me, this is my favourite Banshee design they've actually made. I much more prefer this Combat Evolved style Banshee to the newer ones they've made. I don't know why, it just looks more alien, I don't know how to explain it, I just like it a lot more. That purple as well, something about that Covenant purple that just looks really nice. So next we have the Gaussog from the UNSC Gaussog vs Covenant Locust set. I really like the design of this. The Warthog really stands out with the camouflage green. Mega Bloks always done a good job with their bricks. That camouflage just looks really nice. There's also this small control panel sort of thing in the middle. Just a nice bit of detail there. And the final thing, the Covenant Locust. It looks really nice in my opinion. Obviously there's a lot of studs showing. Uh, nowadays they probably would cover that up with some smooth uh, bricks, I'm not sure. But these lights on the side, they look pretty nice. And I'm not going to lie, I struggled to get this thing standing up. And I don't know if it's fully repaired. I just used what I had in the box to uh, try and fix it. But it looks pretty cool still. There's also this nice little control panel on the front. Again, nice addition to detail. And yeah, that's pretty much the Locust. So, that's everything I've got in the box. Uh, the price of this came up to a total of £36. Let me know if that's a good deal or not. I don't really know prices of Mega Bloks. So, if you're experienced in the field of collecting Mega Bloks, then just let me know what the prices go for for these sets. And I'll appreciate it. Yeah, let me know in the comments what you think of the sets I got. Was it good or was it not? And take care.